I want my homemade wheelchair gun back and not fight as long as I have to to get it back. The wheelchair gun he's referring to is this one. It took Greg Fuggs three years to construct his wheelchair gun. Custom mounted twin AK-47, 600 rounds per minute, extra ammo and a breathing tube to uh, release the trigger mechanism. All in all, a pretty nice weapons profile for a wheelchair, but in the wrong hands, could do a lot of damage. And those hands turned out to be this boy's, nine-year-old Lucas Cole, who found it sitting on Mr. Fuggs' porch. I left it out there for like 20 minutes. And when you, when you came back out? It's gone. I don't know what happened to it. A lot of kids in this neighborhood? Well, you know, I like it when kids come by. Unfortunately, some kid did come by, as seen here in this reenactment. But just when it seemed the shooting spree was going to end, Lucas Cole discovered the ultimate prize for a boy who had stolen a wheelchair gun. I'll tell you, I, I'll never forget the sound. You know. <laughs> Lucas Cole proceeded to open fire on a mirror store. I just hope something good can come out of this. What possible good could come out of that? I know, you know, I'm just lucky to be alive, but uh, part of me can't stop thinking, why me? Why my mirror store? I keep thinking that what if the kid who stole the wheelchair, if it come this way, it would have been my store, my mirror store instead of Ed's. <sighs> I mean, you just never know, you know? I mean, you, it, honestly, that's a one in a million that you leave a wheelchair gun out and... Greg. Are you crying? <laughs>